Hello friends, welcome to Action Script video tutorial series. From the past few video tutorials, we are trying to understand operators in Action Script. In the previous video tutorials, we have already discussed almost all operators available in Action Script. We understood logical operators, arithmetic operators, relational operators, assignment operators, bitwise operators, increment and decrement operators conditional operator and special operators. We left with one more topic with respect to operators that is precedence and associativity. In this video tutorial, I would like to discuss precedence and associativity of action script operators. What is precedence? What is associativity? Why we need to know precedence and associativity? If you understand the precedence and associativity of operators, you can very easily understand how exactly the expressions are evaluated by the action script engine. It also helps you in debugging programs later. So let's understand what is precedence, what is associativity. While evaluating a given expression, while evaluating a given expression, which operator should be evaluated first before the other? That is, which operator needs to be given higher precedence than the other is determined by the precedence. You can see here we have multiplication operator, we have division operator, we have plus operator, we have minus operator, we have equal to operator in a single expression. Now precedence determines whether multiplication operator should be evaluated first before the others or plus operator should be evaluated first before the others. Then what is associativity? If same operator appears one or more times in an expression, in which direction the specific operator or operators need to be evaluated is determined by the associativity. You can see here we have plus operators three times. Whether we have to evaluate these plus operators from left to right or right to left is determined by the associativity. Equal to sign has the right to left associativity. So right hand side expression will be evaluated first, the result will be assigned to the left hand side variable. While evaluating any given expression, action script engine refers this table, precedence and associativity of action script operators table. This table is going to be referred by the action script engine while evaluating any expression. On the left hand side column, we have precedence level. 12 levels we have. Note, lower the precedence level number, higher the precedence. Lower the precedence level number, higher the precedence. You can very easily remember the precedence table by remembering this shortcut. P umasre blcac. P umasre blcac. P for parenthesis. U for unary. M for multiplicative. A for additive, S for shift, R for relational, E for equality, B for bitwise, L for logical, C for conditional, A for assignment, C for comma operator. Parenthesis has the highest precedence than any other operators and comma has the lowest precedence than any other operators. Note, lower the precedence level number, higher the precedence. Okay. After parenthesis, unary operators having the pre precedence like that, downward. Plus, plus, that is increment operator, decrement operator, plus, minus, exclamation mark, tilde character, delete, new type of operators are unary operators, right? If you see here the associativity carefully, unary operators and assignment operators are having right to left associativity and all others are left to right. Let's have a demonstration and understand clearly how this precedence and associativity table help us to understand how exactly the expressions are evaluated by the action script engine. Let me go to flash. You can see that I have already launched the Adobe flash IDE. I click on action script 3.0 to create a new action script file. I go to timeline, click on the first frame, go to window menu, click on actions to get the actions window. Here I am going to say were a, I create one variable called as a of type number. To that, I assign an expression 2 plus 
2 plus 2 semicolon. Then I say trace A. What output we get here, friends? Before evaluating this expression, the action script engine checks what are the operators are there. Equal to plus two operators are there. And then it goes to the precedence. You can see that the plus operator has the higher precedence than the equal to. So the plus operator should be evaluated first. Then the plus operator has the left to right associativity. So the leftmost plus will be evaluated first, then the next plus left to right it is going to be evaluated. 2 plus 2 is 4, 4 plus 2 is 6. Then the equal to sign or the assignment operator has right to left associativity. So the right hand side value 6 will be assigned to A. We get the output 6 displayed on the screen. Here I say 2 plus 2 plus 2. If I hit control enter, you see the output displayed there 6. This is how the expressions are evaluated friends. Let's take one more example. I create var A. No, no, no. You should not have two variables with the same name in the same scope. I told you before also while discussing naming variables. So I'm going to remove this. I say B colon number. I assign another expression this time. The expression is going to be 2 plus 3 multiplied by 5 semicolon trace display the value of B. What output we get friends here? Can you guess? You may be thinking 2 plus 3 is 5. 5 into 5 is 20. No, that is wrong. We don't get 20 there. First, the action script engine checks what are the operators are there. We have equal to plus and multiplication. It goes to the precedence table and checks which operator need to be evaluated first before the other. So here, multiplicative operators are having the higher precedence than the plus. Plus operator has the higher precedence than the assignment. First multiplication, then plus, then equal to. Let's go back. 5 into 3 will be 15. 15 plus 2 is 17. Then 17 will be assigned to B. We get the output 17, not 20 here. Let me write it back. 2 plus 3 multiplied by 5. If I hit control enter, you see the output displayed there 17, not 20. That is how the precedence and associativity table is referred. Next, word C of type number. I give another expression so that you people get comfortable with the precedence table. 3 into 5 plus 4 divided by 2 plus 3. Trace the value of C. What output we get friends here? Try yourself, pause the video and check, solve this expression and see what output you get. And check whether you have understood whatever I am explaining properly or not. You may be thinking it is going to be evaluated from right to left. 3 into 5 is 15 plus 4 is 19. 19 divided by 2 is 9.5 plus 3 is 12.5. You may be thinking the output is 12.5. No, that is not right. First it checks what are the operators are there. Multiplication, division, plus, equal to. Then it goes to the precedence. Multiplicative operators are having the higher precedence than the additive. Additive operators are having higher precedence than the assignment. So first multiplication and division should be evaluated, then plus, then equal to. Again, multiplication and division are in the same level. So they have to be evaluated from left to right. What happens here? 3 into 5 will be evaluated first, 15. Then the division, 4 divided by 2 is 2. 15 plus 2 is 17. 17 plus 3 is 20. So we get the output 20, not 12.5. Let me write that expression back again. 3 into 5 plus 4 divided by 2 plus 3. If I hit control enter, you see the output displayed there 20, not 12.5. I hope you guys have calculated and got the result 20. Let's see were D of type number. One more example I give. This time I use parenthesis in an expression. So 3 into in bracket I say 5 plus 4 divided by 2 plus 3. This is how 
we write the expression and let's see what output we get here trace the value of d we have here parenthesis multiplication division plus operator equal to if you see the precedence table parenthesis has the higher precedence so first parenthesis will be evaluated 5 plus 4 is 9 then multiplication and division are having the higher precedence than the additive and they have left to right associativity first left hand side operand will be evaluated 9 into 3 will be how much 27 27 divided by 2 how much it will be 27 divided by 2 is going to be 13.5 plus 3 is 16.5 so we get here 16.5 right let me write the expression back again here I am going to write the expression 3 into 5 plus 4 bracket divided by 2 plus 3 semicolon if I hit control enter you get 16.5 on the output you are correct let's see one more example this time I say were e of type number equal to I use this expression let's take this expression and evaluate what output we get here I say control V semicolon trace the value of E can you guess the result here this time we have equal to multiplication division plus minus multiplicative operators are having higher precedence than the additive operators and multiplicative operators are having left to right associativity 3 into 5 will be evaluated first that is 15 then 4 divided by 2 will be evaluated that is going to be 2 then we have additive operators they have left to right associativity 15 plus 2 is 17 17 plus 2 is 20 then 20 plus 20 is 40 40 minus 10 is what 30 so output should be 30 let me copy that expression again and paste the expression back here if I hit control enter you see the output displayed there 30 I hope you guys have clearly understood the precedence and associativity I suggest you people to watch this video again and again understand because it is one of the most important concept friends for this video tutorial we'll stop here for more benefits and be up to date please subscribe to my youtube channel and don't forget to like comment and share these videos with others so that everyone will get benefited keep learning keep coding keep sharing thank you guys thank you very much see you in the next tutorial